this is Cindy Holt. We're going to start our cool down at the beach here. You know, I take photographs of uh, my sunsets at my beach I live at, and I got challenged by one of my Facebook readers to do my sunsets in clay. So this is what we're going to do. This is a very special clay. It's got a tooth to it that we're going to use. It's a polymer clay, an oven-baked clay. And you see, I've just put a line of ink on here, and I'm using a needle to spread it because brushes will be ruined quickly with the alcohol inks. I'm going to add my water here. I've added my sand. I'm going to put a little bit of water on here. And while the water is sitting there kind of soaking in, I'm going to add some sunset colors up here. Ooh, yeah. I'm going to bring my water down to meet with my sand. Now, of course, when these mix, they're going to add a green, which is very prevalent in my water at my beach also. And this clay is got a great tooth to it so that the inks absorb quickly into it and don't pool on the surface. Of course, I've run it through the pasta machine. It's been well conditioned. And I use about a medium setting for the clay. You, do, you can make it as thick or as thin as you want, really. Let's add a little bit more water here, over here. And some sky up here. There we go. And I'm going to blend it in. Now, just pretend that I've had all my sky up here and I bring down my, my red sunset here, like that. I'm going to add a drop of yellow for my sun. Now, here's the interesting part. I need to add some white. And truly, this came out of laziness because I didn't want to get up from my table. Uh, this is a piece of stringing wire. And I'm going to put my white on there to add the white caps to my piece here. And I'm going to jump over to a piece that I have that I wanted to put some more white on. You see, I've completed it. I have two suns on here because I'm going to cut out two pieces from this. And I can use the wire to just put the froth and the foam from the ocean on here. It's really a perfect way to do this. And I can bring it down so that, oh, I needed to put some more reflection on this sun. So I can put lots of white caps on this water if I want to or clouds up here once the ink is dried and it dries very quickly on this clay surface. I can take my templates and here's one piece and I'm going to cut it out and we're going to bake it according to our manufactured directions and you see I have two pendants. This is kind of like a winter sun and a summer sun and we're all set. Bake it Create your pendants and you have a beautiful summer cool down at the beach.